Hello, hello, this is part 5 of the series, and I've done a lot since the last video, and one of the first things is, I ended up getting a few mining talismans. I didn't spend a whole lot of money, but I just thought to get a little bit extra mining fortune, I would buy some of these talismans. Now, these aren't max upgrades at all, but any fortune will help. Now, another thing I did was, I got mining equipment. So, what I did was reforge the equipment to glistening, which gives more mining fortune. I am still using an ender cloak, but that is only because I didn't want to spend 5 million on an ancient cloak. I will need to recom all these later so I can get more fortune, but that will be a later project. I also bought a bee pet because of its perk, grants 24 fortune of each type, and I put a bejeweled collar on it too, for more mining speed and mining fortune. Also, my setup is now one Devon chest plate and three fourths mineral, and the reason for that is because I'm mining ores, I'm not mining gemstones right now. And the reason for that is because I don't make a lot of money gemstone mining. So currently, I am just mining coal. I'm at 3.3 million collection, so I've mined quite a bit of coal, but not too much either. So I think we're caught up. What I want to do in this video is I want to get full Devon's armor, and I want to start maxing my gear out. As you can see, we still have two-fourths Devon. So we still need the third and fourth piece. Now I need about 50 million if I want to buy the next piece and I think I'm going to sell all my coal. Now a lot of people will probably be upset if I insta sell but I've had coal orders up for the past two or three hours and none of them have filled. So I will just sell. Now that puts me at 50.5 million. So I'm going to check auction house and see what the prices are looking like. But I did look about 10 minutes ago and I saw one for about 50 million. Alright, and as you can see, we just bought Jaded Devon Leggings. Not bad at all, these leggings are probably worth 60 something million, so I ended up saving around 15 million, which is about what I've saved on every other piece. But we only need one more piece until we are maxed, and then we just need to work on the gemstone slots. Currently, we've got fine in every single one of them, and we need to get flawless, and then we're going to upgrade to perfect. But we're going to need at least another 50 million, probably about 50 five million for the helmet so what we're gonna do is get back into mining so we've done quite a bit of mining and i'm just gonna go ahead and start selling all my coal now i could insta sell for 2.5 mil or i could put in a sell offer for an extra 200k but the issue is i've been putting sell offers up all day and they just aren't filling so i'm just gonna instantly sell i'm just gonna sell the rest of my sack instantly and that brings my balance up to 25.8 million i also sold a legendary armadillo for two mil because i hatched one of the eggs and got a legendary so that gives me another two million i'm at 27.8 mil now i also got a bunch of rock pets that i want to sell to george the first one gives me 10k the second one gives me 50 third one gives me 500 k and the fourth one gives me 2.5 million now the last one will give me 10 million coins but i am not quite there with the milestone i'm very close but i'm still 73k ores away so i'm just about 19 million coins away from reaching that but it is pretty late so i'm gonna go ahead and complete this tomorrow currently i have three pieces of devon's armor tomorrow in the morning i'll have my final piece and then i'm gonna work on getting flawless gemstones in my armor and then once i've got that i'm gonna work on getting perfect gems in my armor we are about 36 hours away from derpy so i've got 36 hours to get all the perfect gemstones in my devon's armor and my gauntlet another thing i have a guardian pet now i didn't buy this from the auction house but i did end up upgrading my guardian pet at cat for a very cheap price so what i'm gonna do is use the table and i'm gonna keep using the table throughout derpy so my enchanting level is going to go up quite a bit i haven't done the enchant table in about four days because i ended up unlocking pristine and then just not doing it again but there is a lot of enchants that i will need i think i need at least enchanting 36 for all the enchants 
ones. So I still have quite a while to go. Okay, I just got enchanting 25 and I just got my guardian pet to level 71. I did the table the maximum amount of times I can do. Normally there's a button here that allows you to do the table more times if you pay using bits and XP and that's exactly what I did. And that's what I'm going to be doing throughout all of Derpy because I want to be able to get the maximum amount of enchanting XP that I can get. But what I'm going to do now is I actually want to collect my fishing minion. I've got a lot more collections unlocked and I got to fishing level 7 with that so that's not bad. Now the reason why I put up this fishing minion was so I can unlock the sack of sacks. The sack of sacks is really nice for storing sacks in my menu so I don't need to keep it in my inventory. So if I do slash sacks, I have a small menu here. Now if I get higher up in the collection I will get more slots which will be very convenient. But this is my normal inventory. I have this many sacks on me and sometimes I even have one more. I'll have the gemstone sack. So my inventory gets pretty full so that is why I have my fishing minion down. Hello hello it is the next day and I want to get my final piece of Devon armor. Now I've done a little a bit of mining I've got about 17 million in coalish so i'm gonna sell this that puts me at about 50 million exactly now i saw a nice devon helmet on the auction house for about 50 mil so what i'm gonna do is buy that all right and just like that we bought the helmet so now we have the full devon's armor oh there we go finally i am very happy to have full devon's armor and we are 11 days eight hours into the profile so we have been slacking a little bit but it's all right we are going to start making a ton of money derpy's about to happen so i am going to try to get the rest of my setup pretty quickly so we are going to do a nucleus run now I'm hoping to get either Jada Root or a Devon Frag at least. I did one before and got Pico Nimbus, so it was it was pretty bad. I won't be too upset if we don't get anything good, but a cheeky alloy would be nice. Oh, my inventory is full. So, oh, Jada Root. Okay, that is very nice. Let me just get out my gemstone sack. Put all this in. Okay, so if we bizarre, wait. Oh my god. Okay, we got a quick claw. This this changes everything. We got three Pico Nimbuses, Jada Road, and a Quick Claw. We made like a hundred and twelve million off this run. Not only that, but we also have a ton of fine gemstones that we can sell. Honestly, I'm lost for words. Lowest price is 109 million and the Jade Road order just failed. Okay, we just auctioned the Quick Claw. I wasn't expecting to actually drop anything crazy. I was just hoping for a Jade Road and we ended up getting a Jade Road, Pico Nimbuses and a Quick Claw. So now with that money, I don't actually know what to do with it. I'm probably going to upgrade my Devon armor, but we have to wait for the Quick Claw to sell first. So... The Quick Claw has sold. So we can now claim that and we have 110 mil in our purse now. So I thought about it and I want to get a Bow Pet. Now I don't want to spend too much money. Lowest bin is 29 mil, but I can buy a level 82 for 31.1 million. So I'm probably going to do that. There's no pet candy on here, so I will buy this one. Okay, now we don't need to use this bee pet anymore, so I might auction this one. This bow pet gives me 12.3% on all stats when inside the magma fields. That's the reason why I bought this, because I'll be able to get more mine in fortune, speed, and pristine. Now, I've got about 80 million left, so what I'm going to do is put flawless gemstones in my armor and gauntlet. I don't know if I have enough, but I'll just see how far I can go. Okay, we're at the gemstone grinder now. What I'm going to do is buy all the gemstones I need need and hopefully I'll have enough. Okay, we have 25 million left in the purse and I'm going to start off with my gauntlet. So I'm going to remove the fine topaz and the fine jade. And I'm going to put that in. Okay, that's the topaz bit done. And now I'm going to do the armor. 
I'm gonna have to remove all the gemstones out of here. Okay, and that is done. So we have about 25 million left over, and I've got my armor to full flawless, and my gauntlet is flawless with the gemstones that actually affect mining. So the next thing I want to do is work on getting perfects. Now, what I'm going to do is get perfect topaz first in the slots. Every perfect topaz costs about 13.3 million. I'll be able to buy nearly two. I might put in a buy order just so I can afford two. Okay, I just put in a buy order and my buy order instantly filled. I was not expecting that. That's some good luck. So I'm going to put that in my chest plate and my helmet. We now have perfect topaz in my helmet and chest plate. But this is the end of the video for now. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. See you in the next one.